Maddie Glab here with Saran Neal. It's time for five questions with. All right, I can't believe I'm saying this, but you are going into your fifth season as a Buffalo Bill. Time flies or it's gone by extra slow. What are your goals going into season number five? For me, it's take it to the next level. Take it to the next level and like you say, year five and it went by pretty fast. So right now for me, it's definitely taking it to the next level and being that player that, you know, I never been before. Actually doing more, doing more on the team, doing more for you know, my teammates and exceeding. I feel like, you know, this is a good year to be great, you know, like every year, but going to year five and then definitely after, you know, what has happened, you know, just being great. Because of your skill set and the way that the NFL is played today, defenses are talked about a lot more as like positionless players are keys in defenses. I look at you and you seem like you are somebody who fits in that positionless player role. Uh, how do you see yourself fitting into a role where you can mold and shift and change and morph into different types in different positions within a defense because of your skill set, like you said, inside, outside, linebacker. Uh, definitely being flexible, knowing what you got to do once you get in those, you get in those positions. From so playing outside, you know, you gotta, of course you got to be fast, and I'm pretty fast, you know, so I can play outside to nickel and get back to linebacker because I'm, I'm not small at all. I'm pretty big. I'm a, I'm a big guy, so it's like definitely getting in the box and getting, in, getting outside whenever they need me to. I definitely can do it pretty flexible. All right, the secondary is known for being a quick group of guys. You talked about how you have to be speedy to play on the outside, but if you guys had to race each other, who's finishing first, second, and third amongst the secondary? On oh, defense? On defense. Oh, I'm definitely finishing first All right. off top. Okay. I mean, you can go I mean, ask duh, the boys. Duh. And then, you know, you ask the coaches. But uh, Who's I got number two, number three. Oh, number definitely three. Taryn. Taryn? Taryn Johnson. Okay. For sure, Taryn Johnson. Um, Who's coming in third? Third. I'm going to probably get between uh, Nick McLeod and Cam Lewis. Ooh, all right. Yeah, um, out of all of us, <laughs> I'm definitely going to be the it's first. You. But Taren, but Taren, but Taren's pretty fast, though. Taren's a close Taren, second. He, he'd probably be right in my pocket, to be real. Mm -hmm. He's pretty fast. Pushing you faster. Yeah. All right, we know that you have quite the closet from shoes to accessories to clothes. So if you had to like give me a summer look for Saran, what are you putting on in your off day? On my off day, depends on the weather. It's it's a nice day outside, it's warm. It's warm. We're in Buffalo, we're in Florida, wherever, wherever is warm to you. Ooh. I'm definitely throwing on a pair of nice shorts, probably, you know. Give me the brands too, I, I wanna know what you like. Uh, I might put on uh, some St. Michael shorts or Eric Emanuel shorts um, with a nice, you know, vintage t-shirt, pretty big, not tight. Um, throw on a couple of necklaces, nice pair of shoes. What what type of shoes are you rocking with? Um, I'm more of a comfortable guy, so whatever goes along with it, you know, it, it, I'm, re I'm really not a, a, a favorite guy when it comes to my shoes. I love all my shoes, you know, it's equal. So whatever, like, like a low top, definitely a low top in the summertime. Okay. High top, winter time, but I'm definitely a low top guy in the summertime. Uh, low socks on, you know. Uh, Are we accessorizing with like a hat, a bucket hat or sunglasses? It depends. It all depends on what you're feeling like, you know. We got a side bag going on too. A nice chill day, you know, say we say we, go, we get on the boat or something, I might throw a bucket hat on. Okay. Um, chill day, going to grab some eat, probably a nice little truck, truck of hat. Styles by Saran. I like it. We might have to do a series later on where, where we just oh, get to sure. check out all the fits I'm, I'm, that you got going I'm thinking, on. I'm thinking about doing something here, you know, um, how to put the outfits together Ooh. without without being uh, without it being expensive. What, yeah. So basically more like a, a bit like a... a you can do that. That's yeah. easy. Yeah, like a little nice little store or something. Just throw something together. Because it, it ain't all about the money. It's mm -hmm. not all about, you know, name brands. Mm -hmm. Or whatever, it's, all just a, it's about how you put it on. Yeah, like I tell people it? all the time, it's you wearing the clothes, not the clothes wearing you. Exactly. Yeah. Uh, okay, last question for you. So we're going into the part of the off season where you guys truly get to chill. You get to be wherever you want to be, training with family. 
what are you going to do? Do you have any fun plans? I hear there's another kid along the way. Oh, uh, yeah, I got So my... you're going to be a father of three? three. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, <gasps> man. Oh. Yeah, I got my twin girls and uh, I got my son on the way. Oh, my gosh. I got me a boy on the way and that's it. We're Brand new having no more, no more <laughs> kids. But the summer for me is it's definitely it's definitely not the time to chill. No. No, nah, I got like you said, I got another kid on the way, so that means I got more responsibility. And right now for me, you know, being a father is a huge step in my life. Uh, things I gotta get done. So that's how I attack everyday life. And dad gets to be around the kids more in the oh, summertime. For sure, for sure. Sometimes, you know, you, you probably not seen me. Last year, I was running with the kids in my backyard. They understand daddy's job, and when daddy got to go, daddy got to go. <laughs> and, you know, just trying to give them a life that I never had as a young child, and, you know, that's huge for me right now. Well, you're doing a great job with that. You're into your second contract, Saran. <laughs> Big things happening here. Will you enjoy the time that you're going to have this off-season? Enjoy the time with the little ones and the other one along the way. But thanks for answering some questions. That's five questions with Saran Neal.